The tragic death of the teen girl and the DeMar Hamlin injury are renewing the debate over football safety. One family has been tackling that issue for the past decade after losing their son back in 2008. High school sophomore Taylor Haugen took a hard hit to his ribs on the field, causing his spleen to rupture. Despite hours of surgery, he was bleeding to death internally. Doctors told his parents there was nothing they could do to save him. He was just 15 years old. While his loss stunned the sports community, the parents' grief gave way to something much more enduring. They found a way to honor his memory by starting the Taylor Haugen Foundation. It is now the nation's leading advocate of abdominal injury prevention. Joining me now are the parents of Taylor, Brian and Kathy Haugen. Thank you so much for joining us tonight. First off, thank you for your bravery. The world will never forget your son because of all of your hard work. So can you tell us about Taylor and what was he like? Uh, he he was a, a just a light. Um, he he brought joy to everyone. He he had a, a comic heart and uh, and and just a light that he radiated everywhere he went. So given the recent death of the 16-year-old flag football player we mentioned, as well as the situation with DeMar Hamlin, what were your thoughts when you hear about these injuries that are continuing? They, they are. And the unfortunate death of this young 16-year-old is, is devastating. Uh, the fact that she had a heart condition, you know, going into it, that you know is it should be a red flag mm. uh the coaches the parents everybody should be working together on this and not against each other i think we can all agree on that so you've said football was a passion of taylor's what would you say to parents who are hesitant to let their children play the sport you know, my, my wife has coined a phrase that I really, really believe in, and I think most people should. And we did it with RG3 and his mom <clears throat> and called the protective parent. And it's and she said, uh, don't prevent your child from playing the sport that they love. Do your homework to best protect them so they can better enjoy the sport that they love. And we're big supporters of football and all athletics, but we do think it's really important that players, coaches, and and, uh, and uh, parents do what they need to do to do their homework to make sure that their, their child is best protected. I think that's great advice. So what do you want to see changed in the sport to better protect these players? We'd like to see abdominal injury protective gear mandated, especially at the high school level. I mean, the gear that we support and, and endorse and outfit, we've outfit over 7,000 kids across the country. We do a 50-50 matching grant through our YES program, Youth Equipment for Sports Safety. And we've outfit over 7,000 kids. And, and we do it because it's like self-forming Kevlar. Uh, we don't have an interest in the company that, that does it, but we endorse the product. And, um, and most of the pros wear this stuff, y'all. But most kids in high school don't even know it exists, and parents certainly don't know it exists, and, and, and most coaches, they don't know it exists either, but the pros are all wearing this stuff. So we're, we'd like to see some kind of a mandate to get this kind of gear on kids, especially in a secondary school. It's such a such an incredible mission that you and your wife are on. We so appreciate your time tonight, and we'll never forget your son. Brian and Kathy Haugen, thank you for joining us. Thank you, Kelly. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.